welcome to career guidance max playlist in this video i'm going to start the derivatives the derivative means the first basic definition is the f dash of a equal to limit h tends to 0 f of a plus h minus f of a divided by h or instead of that you can write f dash of x also f dash of x equal to limit h tends to 0 f of x plus h minus f of a divided by h if this limit exists differentiation in the limit manner the very the very first basic definition based on this definition i am going to solve one problem for example if we take an f of x equal to root x find the derivative of f of x so find the derivative of f of x means first you can write the derivative formula for f of x f dash of x equal to i will write limit h tends to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x divided by h okay here i'll write limit h tends to 0 in our function f of x equal to what root x here our formula f of x plus h instead of x i am replacing x plus h f of x plus h is equal to i will get root of x plus h i'll write root of x plus h and minus f of x as it is we can write root x divided by h okay when i am substituting h is equal to 0 i will get indefined function that's not possible so that i have to eliminate this h so now i will write limit h tends to 0 i am going to multiply with conjugate i will write root of x plus h minus root x divided by h into root x plus h plus root x divided by root x plus h plus root x. So now you can see a minus b and a plus b. So we will write limit h tends to 0 a minus b into a plus b we can write a square minus b square so that i'll write rim root of x plus h whole square minus root x whole square divided by h into root x plus h and plus root x okay i'll write limit h tends to zero Square the term, I will get x plus h minus x. Root will cancel. Divided by h of root x plus h plus root x. Okay. Here plus x minus x cancel. We will write limit h tends to 0. h divided by h of root x plus h plus root x okay now i can cancel this h numerator and denominator both so now i'll write limit h tends to 0 1 divided by root x plus h plus root x now we can replace h by 0 so that i'll write 1 divided by root of x plus h is equal to 0 plus root x you will get 1 divided by root x plus 1 divided by root x so therefore your answer is 1 divided by root x 1 divided by root x i'll write 1 divided by 2 into root x is this your derivative so based on this problem you will have lots of working examples so try to solve those problems okay refer the book so this is the procedure for uh, finding derivatives based on the formula f dash of a equal to limit h tends to 0 f of a plus h minus f of a divided by h it's like a difference equation based on derivatives okay now we'll do the differentiation uh, basic 
based on problem we can do the differentiation problems before going to start the differentiation problems you just un, uh, know the basic formulas so differentiation of constant with respect to x is zero already you know that differentiation of constant with u here u is a function of x so we cannot uh, put zero here the common constant c so that i'll write here c into d divided by dx of u and differentiation with respect to x uv uv means product rule keeping u as a constant differentiate v and plus keeping v as a constant differentiate u with respect to x and quotient u by v so when u by v you should know denominator always we have to write v square first first we have to write denominator v square this v as a constant in numerator and you can differentiate u u dash minus u is constant differentiate v v dash this is your uh, quotient formula and chain rule so dy by dx equal to here i return uh, dy by du du by dx that means y is a function of u u is a function of x if i divide this du du cancel this du du you will get dy by dx here i taken three variable dy by dx we can write y is a function of u that is dy by du u is a function of v that is i'll write du by dv v is a function of w that's what i written uh, dv by dw and finally w is a function of x i'll return dw divided by dx if i cancel this i will get dy by dx so this one uh, the basic one log x differentiation with respect to x is 1 by x and uh, e power ax differentiation is a into e power ax and here uh, one more basic differentiation formula this one is the very first basic differentiation formula x power n how to differentiate x power n n into x power n minus 1 this n we have to write in a product way and this n I am going to subtract n minus 1 ok this is the basic differentiation formula ok so if you want to attend the problem in differentiation model now you should know all those formulas and a few more formulas also there let's we see what is this so next one uh, derivatives of a trigonometric functions already you know that differentiation of sine cos cos differentiation minus sine this both will be frequently we are using ok and the differentiation of tan x is secant square x cot x differentiation is minus cosecant square x secant x is differentiation is secant x tan x and the cosecant x differentiation is minus cosecant x into cot x ok and the derivative of uh, inverse trigonometric functions so all those formulas you should memory ok and uh, differentiation of sin inverse of x we can write 1 divided by square root of 1 minus x and the cos inverse of x now we will write uh, minus 1 divided by square root of 1 minus x square opposite of sin ok memory like that tan inverse of x differentiation is 1 divided by 1 plus x square cot inverse of x differentiation minus 1 divided by 1 plus x square ok and the secant inverse of x differentiation 1 divided by x into square root of x square minus 1 and cosecant inverse of x we can write the alternate minus 1 divided by x into square root of x square minus 1 ok now we can start the problem the basic differentiations not a derivative it is a differentiation uh, rule I am going to apply here I am going to find dy by dx the given is uh, y equal to x square e power 2x into x square plus 1 whole power 4 so the given I will write here y equal to x square e power 2x and x square plus 1 whole power 4 which is equation number 1 we have to e differentiate this equation with respect to x see here all the terms are in product all the terms are having x we cannot differentiate directly here we have to substitute uh, product rule product rule means already you know that uh, differentiation of uv equal to u into v dash plus v into u dash you are convenient you can take ok so this is the procedure for uh, two variable here you will have three variable so for example here i will write dy by dx equation one i am going to differentiate with respect to x here i will take this x square this is u this is v and this is w in this formula i am going to write here so x square constant e power 2x constant 
and differentiate with respect to x for uh, this x square plus 1 whole power 4 okay and plus next x square constant and x square plus 1 whole power 4 constant I am going to differentiate with respect to x e power 2x okay and plus now e power 2x constant and x square plus 1 whole power 4 constant differentiate x square term okay wow. so now you can differentiate this term x square e power 2x constant and the differentiation of x square plus 1 whole power 4 I will write uh, the differentiation of x power n form so 4 into x square plus 1 whole power 4 minus 1 that is 3 okay and inner term differentiation x square differentiation 2x 1 differentiation 0 I will write 2x okay and plus so next term x square and x square plus 1 whole power 4 constant differentiation of e power 2x so that is our formula is differentiation of e power ax equal to we will return a into e power x in similar manner here a is 2 I will write differentiation of e power 2x is 2 into e power 2x ok and plus next e power 2x and x square plus 1 whole power 4 and differentiation of x square is 2x so that next from the all the term I take an outside of common term in last one e power 2x and uh, 2x and x square plus 1 whole power 4 so here I will take 2x e power 2x and uh, x square plus 1 whole power 3 common term outside see in first one we taken 2x outside here you will have x square so I will write this 4 4 x square only you will have I take an outside e power 2x and 2x x square plus 1 whole cube in second term I will take outside 2 from this x square I will take x outside 2x e power 2x here x square plus 1 whole cube I will take outside so remaining you will get x into x square plus 1 right huh? then last term here e power 2x I take an outside 2x I will take an outside from this 3 I will take an outside so one more term is there x square plus 1 only ok now I will write 2x e power 2x x square plus 1 whole cube and simplify this 4x square plus x into x square x cube plus x 1 into x plus x and this one x square plus 1 right huh? and simplify this you will get 2x e power 2x and uh, x square plus 1 whole cube and uh, the first term x cube second term 4x square plus 6 uh, plus x square we can write 5x square plus x plus 1 so is this our answer dy by dx equal to this answer for a differentiation basic differentiation this one is a important one part they may ask in 4 mark or sometimes in 2 mark ok important one so next problem number 3 implicit differentiation implicit differentiation is, is nothing but uh, in your equation you will have both x and y that is called uh, implicit equation if you are having x and y in same equation means that equation is called implicit equation so here the given values are equation is root x plus root y equal to 1 which is equation number 1 this equation I am going to differentiate because we have to find dy by dx right huh? so this equation one I am going to differentiate with respect to x that means root x differentiation 1 by 2 into root x whenever you are differentiating a root term you can write like this that's enough root x now 1 divided by 2 into root x already you know that how it comes 
root x we can write x power 1 by 2. x power 1 by 2 differentiation 1 by 2 into x power minus 1 by 2. That uh, x power minus 1 by 2 we can shift to denominator. I will get uh, 1 divided by 2 into x power plus 1 by 2. That is we can write root x. So, directly we can write. Here root y also we need to differentiate with respect to y with respect to x. So, 1 divided by 2 into root y. y means we have to write that dy by dx equal to constant differentiation 0. So, from this I will write 1 divided by 2 into root y dy by dx is equal to shift this to right hand side you will get minus 1 divided by 2 into root x and I will write dy by dx equal to minus 1 divided by 2 into root x shift this 1 divided by 2 into root y product term to right hand side take a reciprocal you will get 2 into root y 2 2 will cancel so you will get the derivative answer dy by dx equal to minus root y divided by root x is this your final answer so next uh, problem number 4 find y double dash if x power 4 plus y power 4 is equal to 16 so you can take the given x power 4 plus y power 4 is equal to 16 put to equation number 1 so I am going to differentiate this equation 1 with respect to x. So x power 4 differentiation 4x cube. y power 4 differentiation 4y cube into dy by dx. Whenever you are differentiating y term with respect to x, always you should write this dy by dx. I write and said there is no term this is constant so we will put 0 ok so from this I will write 4y cube dy by dx equal to shift this 4x cube to right hand side you get minus 4x cube ok I will write dy by dx is equal to minus 4x cube shift this 4y cube to right hand side we will write 4y cube product we will get and denominator term in right hand side 4 4 will cancel we will get a dy by dx equal to minus x cube divided by y cube ok so this is we can uh, write y dash then uh, we have to find y double dash so this is equation 2 so both we need to differentiate numerator and denominator here I am going to apply u by v formula what it is u by v formula so denominator always we should write first v square this v is constant in numerator u differentiation u dash and minus u is constant differentiate v that is v dash ok this is for quotient rule formula here I am going to apply when I am differentiating y dash again I will get uh, y double dash differentiate equation 2 again with respect to x ok so y double dash which means d square y divided by dx square already you know that so first I will write denominator v square here v is y cube so v square means we can write y cube whole square this v is constant in numerator that means y cube constant differentiation of x cube so here right outside minus commonly x cube differentiation 3 x square and formula minus u constant that means x cube constant differentiation of y cube is I will write 3 y square and dy by dx ok now multiply with minus minus y cube and 3x uh, square minus into minus plus x cube 3y square by equation 2 here I will write this dy by dx equal to minus x cube divided by y cube so minus x cube divided by y cube divided by y cube whole square we can write 
multiply this 2 3 into 2 6 so y power 6 now here I am going to divide this y square and y cube cancel you will get y and uh, here minus y cube 3 x square and minus 3 this uh, x cube x cube we can multiply power we can add x power 6 divided by y because in denominator you will have y okay divided by y power 6 then now you can cross multiply the numerator term y into y cube 3 x square minus y power 4 and minus 3 x power 6 the common denominator term is y and denominator term y power 6 ok now I will write from this I will take outside uh, minus 3 x square commonly so minus 3 x square I taken outside commonly and here you will have y power 4 here I taken minus 3 x square outside means here you will have x power 4 and divided by this denominator y and 1 by y power 6 we can write y power 6 ok this next year by equation 1 we will write x power 4 plus y power 4 is equal to 16 so I will write here minus 3 x square x power 4 plus y power 4 is equal to 16 divided by y into y6 we can write y power 7 ok so that your answer is minus 3 into 16 minus 48 x square divided by y power 7 which is your uh, second derivative final answer ok so next one uh, derivatives of logarithmic function here for example y equal to x power 6 is this our uh, equation the given equation here we cannot uh, able to differentiate directly so I, here I am going to multiply both side log then only we can able to differentiate this term so that's called this is a logarithmic function model okay so both side multiply with log you get log y is equal to log x power x okay this log x power x what it is the sh log shifting property log a power b we can write b into log a in similar manner here you can write x into log x this is log y okay so i'm going to differentiate this term differentiation with respect to x log y equal to differentiate with respect to x x into log x okay well in left hand side uh, we can differentiate easily because you will have only one term y when differentiating this you will get uh, 1 by y y term differentiation we have to put dy by dx already you know that okay but right hand side you will have x into log x both the term we have to differentiate here you can apply product rule what it is product rule differentiation of u v equal to u into v dash plus v into u dash model so that means keeping x as a constant differentiate log x you will get 1 by x plus log x constant differentiate x you will get 1 okay simplify this 1 by y dy by dx is equal to xx will cancel you will get 1 plus log x right I will write dy by dx is equal to shift this 1 by y to right hand side you will get y 1 plus log x if you are able to simplify this term now you can simplify by equation 1 y is equal to I am going to substitute x power x so x power x 1 plus log x 
so this is dy by dx okay so this is the procedure for uh, differentiating log terms one more problem you can see in this section uh, problem number 6 find y dash that means first derivative if x power y equal to y power x the given is x power y equal to y power x okay so here we cannot differentiate directly so again take log on both side so log of x power y equal to log of y power x by log shifting property this one I am right y into log x based on previous problem x into log y ok so I am going to differentiate with respect to x differentiation with respect to x y into log x is equal to x into log y ok here we need to differentiate y and log x also so product rule and right hand side also we have to differentiate both the term so u and v the differentiation of u v is equal to u into v dash plus v into u dash formula based on that I am going to differentiate so first left hand side keeping y as a constant differentiation of log x 1 by x plus log x constant differentiation of y we can write dy by dx ok in similarly right hand side x is constant differentiation of log y 1 by y into dy by dx because y term and plus log y constant differentiation of x is 1 ok simplify this y by x plus log x dy by dx is equal to x by y dy by dx plus log y so here I'll write dy by dx term right, uh, left hand side remaining term right hand side so that log x dy by dx shift this to uh, left hand side minus xy dy by dx is equal to this plus log y shift this y by x to right hand side you will get minus y by x ok then then now from left hand side dy by dx is a common term I will take outside dy by dx of log x and here minus x by y equal to log y minus y by x ok so now I will write the dy by dx is equal to log y minus y by x divided by this term log x minus x by y so this is your final answer y dash or uh, dy by dx ok so in this video we seen only the basic differentiation problems very simple problems in next video I am going to continue in this section uh, next video we are going to see 8 marks important 8 marks ok thank you Paul.